hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice algebra problem uh, with the help of lambert w function and here we have n to the power of 5 equals to a to the power of n and we will solve this problem for the values of n so the very first thing we are going to do is here first we will take natural log on both of the sides then you will get here log of n to the power of 5 equals to log of 8 to the power of n and after this step uh, we will use the properties of logarithm uh, and we move this exponent of both of the terms in the front of this log and here we obtain 5 times of log of n equals to here you have n times of uh, log 8 and in the next step uh, we move all the terms involving n in the left hand side and the remaining terms in the right hand side so that we move this n in the left hand side and we move 5 in the right hand side and we obtain log of n over n equals to log of 8 over 5 and after this step uh, here we just move uh, n in the left hand side to the upsides so that it will be looks like in this form n inverse of log n equals to log of 8 over 5 and now in the next step uh, here we just take uh, log and anti log on an inverse and uh, you know uh, that if we have uh, a number or a variable n then we will write it in this form n times of log n and you know that this log and anti log are cancelled by each other and you will again obtain n so here we can use this property so that we will write this n inverse as e to the power of log of n inverse into here we have log of n equals to log of 8 over 5 so uh, in the next step uh, we will uh, just again use the property of logarithm and we can move this uh, minus 1 in the front of this log and we will write it as e to the power of minus times of log n into log of n equals to log of 8 over 5 so uh, before moving the next step i can first explain little bit about the uh, lambert w function uh, and you know about this function uh, it will be looks like in this form if you have w of n times of e to the power of n so it will be equals to n so it means that if you have exponent of e then this exponent is multiplied by here and then the output will be the exponent of e which is n so this is called the lambert w function so that uh, here we just convert our given question statement into the standard form of lambda w so that we can apply this w and we get its output and our final answer so here you see that we have the exponent of e is minus times of log n so that here we need to multiply this exponent here so here you see that we have log of n and we need just only this minus sign so that we will multiply here both of the sides by minus 1 uh, to uh, obtain the standard form of Lambert W function. So uh, here we multiply this on both of the sides by minus 1 and you will um, obtain here minus times of log n into here we have e to the power of minus of log n equals to minus times of log 8 over 5 so uh, in the next step uh, you will just see here uh, we will make our given question uh, into the form of a lambert w function so now here we need to apply this w on both of the sides 
or now we can apply the lambda w function on both of the sides then you will get here w of uh, minus times of log n into e to the power of minus times of log n and this is equals to w of minus times of log 8 over 5 so now here we can just apply this w on both of the sides and now we will use here the definition of for lambda w function this is if you have some this form then its output will be the exponent of e so that here you have the exponent of e in the left hand side is minus times of log n so that we will uh, write the next step as uh, minus times of log n equals to w of minus times of log 8 over 5 so uh, in the next step in order to find the value of n here we move this minus sign in the uh, exponent of n so we will be written its left hand side as log of n inverse equals to w of minus times of log 8 over 5 so now in the next step uh, you will see here we remove this uh, uh, log sign so that in order to remove this log sign we will take the anti log on both of the sides and we will write it as e to the power of uh, log of n inverse equals to e to the power of uh, w of minus times of log 8 over 5 so uh, uh, in the next step uh, you will see here uh, this log uh, and anti log are cancelled out each other and you will obtain here these are gone and here we get n inverse equals to e to the power of w of minus times of log 8 over 5 so uh, now uh, in the left hand side we have uh, n inverse and you know that if we will take uh, the uh, reciprocal on both of the sides then you will get this n is positive so here you obtain this n equals to 1 over e to the power of w into minus times of uh, log 8 over 5 so uh, in the next step uh, we will use here the nice property of lambert w function so here in order to simplify this equation we need to use the nice property of lambert w function and you know about this property uh, if you have e to the power of lambert w function of n then we will write it as n over lambert w function of n it means that if you have if you have uh, this value you can just write this value here and we divide the exponent of e here so over e to the power of lambda w function will be written in this form so now we will use this property here and we will uh, we will just uh, write uh, its denominator as it is equals to 1 over after using this property we will write it as because here you have minus time of log 8 over 5 it is n so we write it as minus times of log 8 over 5 and this whole over uh, w of uh, minus times of log 8 over 5. So here we use this property and we get here this notation. Uh, so now we will uh, just rearrange the terms and you will get its output in this form uh, and we will get here. Uh, from this uh, from this you will uh, just uh, get its output or next step in this form minus 5 over uh, log of 8 times of uh, lambda w function of uh, minus log 8 over 5 so here in order to uh, find the exact value you will just use here uh, the wolf alpha function or uh, you will use here the wall form alpha um, and you will easily get the value of uh, this function so i can just write here 
uh, our final answer will be approximately equals to 2.207 and up to so on so this is the our final answer or, or you can just say this is the our final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos